Today you'll learn how to use a blood collection kit and take a blood sample using a Mitra microsampler. The blood collection kit includes either a clamshell or cartridge style Mitra device configuration, lancets, specimen bag with desiccant, gauze, adhesive bandages, and a shipping envelope. First, remove the Mitra device from the specimen bag. Do not remove the desiccant. It should stay in the bag. Next, open the Mitra device to expose the sampling tips. Do not remove the microsamplers from the cartridge. Then twist the caps off the lancets. Now remove the gauze from its packaging. Lastly, unpeel the backing from one side of each bandage. Keep all items within reach. You're now ready to collect a blood sample. To collect a sample that's just right, without over or under sampling, follow these guidelines. Here's what an oversampled and undersampled Mitra tip looks like, compared to a correct sample. If part of the Mitra tip remains white, that's undersampling. Undersampling can occur when you pull the Mitra tip away from the blood drop too quickly, or when there's not enough blood to fill the tip. When this happens, massage from the palm up towards the finger and wait for another blood drop to form. Try again until the sampler tip is fully red, count two additional seconds, and then remove. If there's too much blood, that can result in oversampling. Oversampling is usually caused by three issues. One, the tip is fully submerged in the blood. You want to keep it on the surface of the blood. Two, blood is dripped onto the sampling tip. Three, the tip points upwards towards the sky when it touches the blood. It should point downward towards the floor. Now that you know what causes over and under sampling, you can now get the correct Mitra sample every time. All right, let's get started taking a sample. Once your materials are ready, wash your hands. If after using the lancet, you do not see any blood appear, or if the blood flow stops before you can collect a second sample, massage your finger from the palm upward to help blood flow. If you still don't see any blood appear, use another lancet on a different finger and try again. Okay, let's begin. Vigorously rub your hands to warm them. Then place your hand down and position the lancet just off the center of the finger pad and push down. You'll hear a click. Wipe away the first drop of blood with the gauze. Allow a second drop of blood to form. Apply the first sampling tip to the blood drop. Watch the sampling tip turn completely red and then count two seconds. Gently remove the sampler and apply the second sampler tip until it's fully red also. Put down the device. Use the gauze to wipe away any excess blood and bandage your finger. Close the Mitra device and place it in the specimen bag with the desiccant. Seal it shut. Your Mitra samples are now ready to ship. Place the specimen bag in the shipping envelope and put it in the mail or bring it with you to your next clinic visit. Welcome to the new world of convenient, accurate blood sampling.